hailstorms. They affect our cars, our houses, and our wildlife. Today, we're going to talk about how these dangerous ice pellets affect our Earth. We're going to be going over what are hailstorms, how do they affect us, and how hail is formed. First up is what are hailstorms. Hailstorms are solid precipitation, balls, irregular formed balls of ice. <coughs> these form up in the atmosphere, way, way above us, and they come down, and they're not very necessarily nice. They come down very hard, <coughs> and they can hurt people too. They can also kill people if they're very strong. Our second point is how, how do they affect us? And hail really has the same effect as rainwater, but the fact that it is coming from all the way up in the sky and that it comes down at such a fast rate and can also be dangerous to people is extremely concerning. And on to our third point of how hail is formed. Hail is water droplets, water droplets formed above the freezing level of the clouds. The precipitation and all of the wind up there will then bring these into a swirling effect, which creates the balls of hail. And they and which brings me back to the irregular formed. And they grow when additional water lands on them. So today we talked about what are hailstorms and talked about how they are balls of water that is frozen. And we talked about how they affect us, like our cars, in our houses, in our wildlife as well. And our third point is how hail is formed. We learned that it was formed up in the atmosphere and that <coughs> it's really dangerous. So, today, or the next time that it hails, because we live in Iowa, so we really never know when it's going to hail, I really want you to be prepared, and cars are not even a safe space to be. So, when it hails for the next time, make sure that you're in a basement or a safe space, because hail is very dangerous. Thank you.